we are at round two again. We have a close seating matchup here with the number 12, Downtown Diner, versus 13, The Police Station. Both of these sets are a result of a, an upset in the first round. We had the Downtown Diner, which again is seed 12, beating out seed 5, The Fire Brigade. And we have the Police Station, again that's seed 13, beating out the Cafe Corner, number 4, in our seedings. So we have so, a couple who have really progressed farther than we would have thought into round two. So we'll see which one comes out on top, progressing into round three. Colin, can you give us your thoughts on these two sets? All right, so we've got a breakdown of two modulars that are similar errors to one another. Now, the Downtown Diner really helped reset the modulars with the 50 styles architecture and the turquoise and the pink color. The police station is even a year or two more recent than that, and it's classic architecture, but a lot of really cool details, building techniques, and of course that nice purple colored donut shop uh, that I think really pops in the set. So some really cool color combinations between both of the sets. Um, I do like the sidewalk ambiance on both sets, kind of working my way from the bottom all the way to the top. You've got the really cool plants for the police station, and you've got this uh, nice little parking meter and flower baskets and mailbox for the downtown diner. I might give the edge for the sidewalk ambience because of the, the plants to the police station. Uh, I love the entrance to the police station. The double doors are fantastic. Uh, but that sleek curvature for the downtown diner is fantastic. Really enjoy the way they do that there. And on the upper levels of the downtown diner, I do enjoy the uh, snot work or the sorry the half stud offset windows on the side you've got that jukebox theme running all the way up to the top with that radio tower on the downtown diner which i think goes really nicely and another plus i think for the downtown diner is that it has no real transition in color of plates from one floor to the next they do a great job using snot work and tiles to cover that up and i think that's an underappreciated aspect of the downtown diner but the police station has some virtues as well. I mean, I look at the advertising and I think the way that they do that um, billboard for the laundromat and the brick bank is really cool. And the donut shop and the play features there are pretty cool as well. The color combination pops. Um, so there, there's that variation there that I really kind of enjoy. So this is going to be a tough vote for me. But I'm really curious to hear what Autumn has to say, although I think I know which way she's leaning. The downtown diner is much lighter than the police station. So the police station does have the donut shop that is purple, but the downtown diner just has the pink and the turquoise and the arch is really nice. The police station does have brickwork that looks really nice. Mommy, what do you think? This is a tough one for me. They both are great sets. That Neither of them are my absolute favorite, but they're both really nicely done. The police station is a lot taller. It is three floors, same as the diner, but that main building actually has like almost a half floor below it as well. So it starts a little bit higher. And so it goes up quite tall. This gives it a more spacious interior as well. We have full space from one end of the base plate to the other end for building. So we have quite a bit of interior space to work with, which gives it a more spacious feel inside. We have some nice details, but it's not really crowded in there. The downtown diner has a lot of details on the interior. We have some really cool things on the second and third floor, and I just love the diner feel on the bottom floor with all those interior details. You can check back the, when we talked about the matchup in the first round to see a lot of those interior details that are there. The police station has classic architecture and that ivy coming up the side. The ivy really brings out a lot for me. I think that makes it look a lot nicer. And the little bird with the donut in the window is also a fun little detail on the outside there, giving it a little bit of character in addition to its classical architecture. But what I really love about the police station is that little donut shop on the side. It is just an adorable little shop. I think the purple color makes it, um, makes it much more lively as well. Just that pop of color is great, which makes it, I think, a better matchup to the diner. Since the diner has that color pop, 
having that donut shop alongside the police station makes it a much stronger contender when we look at the color schemes. The police station also has that nice little newsstand out front and the downtown diner doesn't really have anything that is comparable to it. It's got a little mailbox, but that's not much of anything. So I think those kind of exterior uh, things going on at the police station are a little bit nicer than the downtown diner. The downtown diner on the back side, however, is a little bit more dressed up. It's got that kind of spiral fire escape, so it's got a nicer fire escape than the police station. So two very fine sets, and uh, let's just go to our vote to see which one is going to win this matchup. Kiara, what are you voting for? Downtown Diner. Autumn, which one do you vote for? Downtown Diner. Colin? It's a tough one, but I think the diner's underrated. I'm going to go with the diner. All right, I'm really on the fence with these two. Since Colin said the diner, I'll say the police station because that one's a great set too. That gives us three for the diner and one for the police station. The diner is moving on. All right, so that wraps up this round. Make sure you ring the bell for notifications. That way you don't miss any of the rest of the second round or for subsequent rounds. Make sure you subscribe to the channel as well. I know if you're watching this, there's a chance you haven't done that. So make sure you do that because it helps us out. And always remember, keep, keep building, building together. together.